Okay, so I'm making this video just to show you what to do if you're in the situation where you're putting iPhone footage into Final Cut Pro and then it's showing up quite uh, bright, basically. So I'm going to show you an example. So I'm going to take this clip here and I'm going to move it into Final Cut Pro. This was recorded from my iPhone and you can see immediately just how overexposed this image is. In fact, I'm going to show you a second one. Let's look at this one. Let's have a look at this one here. So let's delete that one. Can see how bright and overexposed this is the first thing i don't want you to do a lot of people do this is they go to opacity here and they turn that down to like 10 percent and that looks good when you're editing on final cut pro but the problem is when you render the video and upload it onto youtube uh, it just comes out quite dark so try to avoid putting opacity down to 10 percent. so leave that at 100 percent what you need to do is go to the effects menu here. So you press this button, the effects will show up. And on the bottom here, you search for HDR and you get something called HDR tools. So just stick this and drag it over the clip. That improves it slightly, but it's still not, it's still overexposed. So on the top here under effects, sometimes this is hidden like this. So press show for effects and HDR tools will show up. Change this to HLG to, R to REC 709 SDR, so the second one. So when you change that, that will bring it up back to normal. Now, second thing, if you want to do this for multiple clips, so let me just put a few clips on here. You'd need to have the effects on one clip before you copy and paste it to the other clips. What you have to do is press Command and C and just copy the clip. And then you press Command and click each one of the clips you want the effects to go on to. And you press Edit and Paste Effects. And it will apply those same effects onto the other clips you've just pasted on. Now, just be careful doing this because if you've got other effects on the clips, like color grading or it, like if you've sped up some of the clips, that will be copied onto the other clips that you do that to. So make sure you've not got any other effects. So do this first before you continue to edit the videos. If you've made a full edit of a video and then start doing this, it's going to mess everything up. So just make sure you do that first. Uh, but I hope this video is useful. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe. And thank you for watching.